the Apache attack helicopter, designed to hunt and destroy the enemy, capable of flying more than 200 miles per hour and packed with Hellfire missiles and rockets. After Prince Harry had his first tour of Afghanistan cut short, he was desperate to return to the front line. And he did that with this helicopter, deploying with 662 Squadron as an Apache pilot. The Prince transferred from the Household Cavalry Regiment to 3 Regiment Army Air Corps. His role was to provide air support to troops on the ground across Helmand province in Afghanistan. His second tour was more public, but one he relished over four months. I think it was important to him that um, because he'd served on the ground already with the HCR that he could go, and, go on and um, progress and do something uh, where he was putting that support back to them. And what was it like to work with him? Absolutely fantastic, you know, he's down to earth human being, you know, and uh, it was one of the team, fantastic. It's an absolute honour, I mean I was lucky enough to work with uh, Captain Wales back in 2011-2012 um, and he's such a genuine hard working individual to have the honour to actually be his wedding day itself is just amazing. 250 military personnel are providing support to the royal wedding. And these next few days in Watersham Flying Station are about making sure everything is perfect. Oh, Many troops only returned from Exercise Joint Warrior just days ago. I wouldn't say the Army Air Corps are well known for ceremonial drill. Uh, you know, our, our core role is uh, delivering uh, the Apache attack helicopter. But you know, our, our men and women are absolutely fantastic, and you know, in a short period of time, they will polish themselves up so that they can be uh, on parade with the best. Twenty-three soldiers, one senior sergeant, and one officer will form a half company on Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's big day. No! lining the street outside St George's Chapel in Windsor and presenting the newlyweds and the royal family with the royal salute. It's what I'm most nervous about, I suspect, uh, but we will be stood outside the Galilee uh, gate um, through which uh, Her Majesty the Queen and the senior members of the royal family uh, will leave uh, the ceremony to wave off uh, the newlyweds uh, and we will be uh, positioned at that gate uh, ready to, to salute them as they step outside the chapel. Working with 3 Regiment Army Air Corps was Prince Harry's last taste of the front line before he left the armed forces. And the regiment are extremely proud to send him on his way to married life.